Hello Year 3, it's Mr Brendan here to talk you through Wednesday's English work for Week 7 of the Online Learning. Now we're going to be identifying layout and style features in different texts. So let's look at the helpful hints box first. There are many types of non-fiction texts and each has its own special layout features and styles which help the reader know the type of text. For example, instructions normally have clear, numbered steps and imperative or bossy verbs to tell the reader what to do. So in this text uh, task, you are going to fill in a table like this. Okay, you'll need to do that on a separate piece of paper. And you need to list the layout features and the style features of these types of text. Now, before we do that, I'm going to remind you of some of the features of the texts. So subheadings, pictures, bullet points, of which we have some here. It might be written in the first person, for example, I, we. There might be short, clear sentences. So hopefully you've got a, a few ideas and they've helped you to remember some other ones as well. So the first one they've done is contents page and they've told that the layout features are that is at the front of the book, has page numbers, titles of pages, and contents written at the top of the page. And the style features, headings only, no additional text. Let's look at the second one, the report text. So they've showed us the style features, technical words, paragraphs, varied sentence beginnings, facts, not opinions. Now what else might you see in a report text? Have a think. Okay, yeah, you might see a main heading, maybe you'd see subheadings. Information might be in bullet points. There might be paragraphs, photographs, okay? These are lots of things you know, but I'm just helping you with this one. Okay, because that's report text. Now instruction text, what would you see in instructions? Well, you'd see some of those same things again, wouldn't you? And the style would need to be short and clear. Now have a think, remember what you can, and some of them, some of the layout features and style features will feature in more than one type of text. Okay, what would be great is if you could look for some of these type of texts online at home, and this will really help you with identifying the layout and style features. Okay, thank you, Year 3. See you tomorrow.